today we are going to be driving Euro Truck Simulator 2. Today we are driving a DAF truck. DAF meaning DAF. And supposedly this does not have cruise control. We're going to go. Wow. That click was really annoying. So we're going to go to options real quick. Controls. Oh, we're going to go to audio first. Sound effects. And go down like that. There we go. There we go. Um, now we're going to go to, oh, we screwed that up. Options, keys and buttons, cruise control, cruise control, cruise control, trailer brake, eh, add trailer brake, and eh, we don't care about our advisor. Cruise control, where is cruise control at? Cruise control. Oh, okay. Yeah, it has cruise control. I bet it does. It just had a stupid button for it. So, get out of this screen. So, we got a truck here. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Um. Okay, let's go to, um, there we go. We're going from, yeah, I don't know where we're going. I, this is Euro Truck Simulator 2. I'll show you guys the map real quick. You guys want me to do that. Okay. We'll show you guys the map where we're going. World map over here. We're going from this town over to this town. Got it, get it, good. Or get it, got it, good. Isn't that how it goes? We got nine hours and ten minutes to go on driving. That's not real time. That's truck time. Or not truck. <laughs> you guys get it. So we're going to get in the truck here. We'll start her on up. Put her in a gear. Pull off the hazards because we're not driving. And we're driving on the right side because obviously we're in Europe. Or over um yeah, we're in Europe. We're in Euro truck segment. And we had to drive like that because we, this is a automated automated gate and so this pro truck right ooh there we go now let's go see if this truck has cruise control and it does No, it doesn't. This truck does not have the cruise control. These DAF trucks do not have cruise control. Are you freaking kidding me? Are you freaking kidding me? This doesn't have cruise control. So we're going to be driving nine hours not not real time game game time we'll call it that game time with no cruise control sounds fun sounds really And it freaking stall almost stalls out too when I give it a little gas. Or 
diesel. That's a, these, I think Euro trucks still have diesel. I don't know for sure. So anyway, guys, what's going on? How's it going, guys? Um, haven't I haven't I haven't been on this game for a while. Um, um, the update is on. I actually didn't even um look at the um trailer things, uh, the trailer hookups. So we'll actually do that sometime within the game. Um, we'll watch fuel and maybe even do a mid-run fuel stop. Had to get out of that lane zone. Um, I can't wait until I get um, some money saved up because I want to get the track IR. Um, we're gonna, I gotta get our harvest lane now too. You're freaking kidding me. Four wheelers just freaking flying by. That's what us truck people's call the cars. The four wheelers. Them four wheelers flying by. I got something stuck between my fingers. He ju jumped right over here too. I can't believe I don't have cruise control. Oh, there we go. I guess it just doesn't key in. Okay, I guess it just doesn't key in at low speeds. Whoa, that car was flying and it didn't want to stop for us. We're going to key it in at um, um, speed limit's 80k. We're going to. It's at 81. But anyway, guys, I haven't done this game for a while now. So, how's it going? <laughs> I was going over in the Euro Truck world. Um, I did a few um, live streams over at twitch.com slash, I guess it's slash, not at. I, I thought it before it was at, then for a while I was just doing twitch.com and my, I was just doing Patrick. And now um, twitch.com and then I was just doing my thing, my handle I guess. Um, I think it's called twitch.com slash Pat. Harm, Harmon, 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 sorry, it's true to my own last name. It's Pat Harmon, H A R M O N, 1 4. So, same thing as my Twitch. And as soon as I can, which, I'm working really hard to get my get my YouTube going full stream here. As soon as I can get my YouTube doing the same thing, I'm going to brand everything Pat Harmon 14. I know it's not a gaming thing. I know Spears HD and all that stuff, and Jeff Fabiano and all that stuff. But I, I'm gonna brand it that way. Maybe eventually I'll brand it something different. But for right now, I'm gonna brand it that way. But um, been working a lot behind the scenes on a uh, setup for Farming Simulator 2017, at least not 20. I believe it's 2019. Oh. Uh, looks like we gotta stay in this lane. Nope. Uh, yep, that's one. Start of toll road. Okay, we're on toll road, I guess. I it's supposedly truckers don't like toll roads because um they cost a lot. But so we just got out of cruise control, so we got to get back going here. But anyway, guys, I've been working a lot on Farming Simulator 2017. I know in my last video, I believe, oh, no, I haven't. I didn't actually upload that video because what happened was I did an American Truck Simulator video, and then I screwed around with the maps which ended up not working because they haven't released the actual um, FIBA um, Mexico, Mexicano whatever map Mexicano map so um, they've re released the one that you can, you, ha you can use it with the DLC the New Mexico DLC but they have not released the one that you can oh we gotta get out of this one again 
don't have the goods I can just put it. But they have not released the one that has the one without the DLC. And I really don't understand the logic behind that. Whoa. I thought I was going to be able to pass the guy. Yep, we're going to be able to pass him now. I think he sped up, though. Just don't know for sure about that. Nope. This guy's about to pass him. He's about to get in front of me. He's going to go around me and around this truck at the same time. Yep. Nope, he's not going to do that. Wow. We're going up a slight incline, it feels like, almost. Yep, he did it. I knew he's going to do that. Trying to stay on the white line, but still. These cars get really close to you in this game. Must have just gotten updated a little bit better than American Truck Simulator. Because once you get closer to that white line, American Truck Simulator um, AI, see, he got he did it. You guys can watch my um, my this right side mirror. Right here. I'm gonna get in that light again if I can. I'm not going that fast. Come on, people. I'll I'll, I'll talk to you guys for a bit in a second. Man, come on. I'm not going that fast. I'm gonna speed up in a second here. I'm trying to get over in this lane, guys. Come on. I'm gonna Let me help her, guys. There we go. I went 10 over the speed limit. <laughs> I, I don't know what else to do. I was going to break and let them all pass me, but... And we'll cruise it back at 8. Yeah, like eight. Come on. There we go. Back down to 80. But, um, yeah, so, man, I must have been tired when I started this game, because the blue thing going up a lot. Oh, there's truck stop. But anyway, guys, so, um, um, so anyway, so I've been working on, uh, Farming Simulator 2017. I actually, uh, made a, um, um, a um, thing within the game that um, it's like a it's a building where I housed I house all my um, trucking um, stuff for building equipment and everything else. Oops, almost forgot that. <laughs> I almost. Wow. <laughs> Wow. But I, this truck is a little cheap though, because they cheaped out and they didn't give me a GPS. I should have got in the truck, but I didn't think I, there was anything in the truck to do. So I don't. So we'll we'll stop by a. Um, oops. Okay, that was the only vehicle. There's always that one vehicle that doesn't want to slow down. They fly by you or don't get another lane. Happens in every city. So anyway, um, so what else? What else? What else? What else? What else? So I've been working on FS17. Trying to think. People usually talk about actual stuff that's going on, not like I, I just talk about random stuff. I talk about races and stuff like that. Watched, obviously I watched the Indianapolis 500. Saw Danica crash last week. I was gonna, I totally forgot. I was going, I was totally gonna do a, um, shoot. Ooh, that's why. We're going at down. Uh, 
I, I was totally going to do a podcast this week, and I think between um, having a couple things happen, um, couple not happen, but a couple things scheduled for Thursday for me, and um, and doing stuff today, I think I really forgot. I totally forgot to do it because I was totally going to do it. I was like, oh, I better do a podcast. I was going to, I was actually, people like to compare. I was going to compare Danica to another person. I'm, I, I guess I was, I was going to, I was going to, when I was watching the race and then I was kind of, when I was hearing the people anticipate Danica race her last race, I was thinking about somebody else. And I always think about this guy. There's two people I think of. When I think of Danica, and I think of people comparing Danica to a person that, or comparing Danica to a lower, um, and I'll talk, we'll talk about this for a second because this isn't really a, my NASCAR channel, and I should have actually talked about this on a podcast, not on my NASCAR, not on my game channel. But there's two people that I always think of when I always think of um, Danica, and when. Not when I think of Danica, but when I think of people talking about Danica and how she's underperforming, she never won anything, she never did this, she never did that. I always think of Ryan Newman and Dale Jr. One of those people I know I'm going to get a lot of hate on. One of those people nobody really cares about. Guess who? Dale Jr., I'm always going to get hate on. Because Dale Jr., is the most popular driver. He got that for so many years and all that stuff. But that doesn't mean anything. Just because you win most popular driver doesn't mean you won anything. You just won a award that literally means nothing. It means that people like you. That doesn't mean that you won anything accomplishable. Like, just because people like you doesn't mean you know, like I, like, it doesn't make like I. You may, it makes sense to me it's that like you didn't win anything. Like, like, just because people like ice cream, doesn't mean it's like I don't know. It, I, I don't know. I don't know. And then Ryan Newman. You know, you can you can argue there's a lot of drivers like Ryan Newman, like Paul Menard, that have won literally only a few races in their entire career we're going up a, a thing but that's all I'm going to talk about on this I really do want to um, make a podcast literally just talking about that because I could talk all day I could look up stats on either driver because um, because within because Dan could only race for um, I think 20, 2011 or not 2011 for it was only she only raced so I, I I think I can't think of on top of my head for like for only like ten like less than ten seasons in NASCAR and if I took the same amount of seasons from maybe two or three other drivers that I'm thinking of that pe it's comparable I'm not thinking of a, I'm not thinking of a Jimmy Johnson or no, I shouldn't say a Jimmy Johnson. I don't like that saying either. If you're just if you're talking about Jimmy Johnson, just say Jimmy Johnson. But anyway, guys, I'm, I'm going to talk, stop talking about that because, like I said, this isn't a. Uh, but we're going up a slight hill because if you see right in front of us, there's a tunnel. So we're going up a slight hill and we're going to go through a tunnel and we finally hit 80, 80 again. We're not in America, so obviously 80 is not 80 miles per hour. 80, 80 kilometers an hour, so that's probably like 65, 65, 70, somewhere on there. So anyway, like I said, so that's all I was going to talk about. But anyway, so um, I'm trying to think. What else I want to talk about? So um, a couple videos I want to do pretty soon are American Trucks. I mean, more American Truck Simulator. Um, I want to finish my series with um, NASCAR Heat 2. I want to do a couple more um, a couple more um, um, 
couple more on um couple more on um Twitch. Um and then probably finish it out on um on um here on YouTube. I don't want I don't I I think I'm doing too much on Twitch and it's not doing me very much. I think I should be probably focusing Twitch more on stuff that actually matters like possibly okay so um, the last time I talked to you guys that just reminded me of something the last time I talked to you guys I was in between um, RP servers I was done with DOJRP and OCRP was not OCRP that is ran by Jeff Fabiano and a few I believe it's ran by his girlfriend slash fiance I don't know if they're married or whatever it's not me to know about, I guess. Um, um, but they um, they contacted me, meaning, meaning OCRP contacted me. They are accepting applications for at least, if you guys want, want to know, they're accepting because they, they, last time they accepted applications was back in. April, I believe. What was last month? May? March. March or April? Yeah, I, think, I believe it was March. Oh, we're going to hit another thing again. Trucks. Trucks, 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 trucks. We're all the way over here, I think. I don't know for sure. Oh. Is there anybody behind me? I'm pretty sure I wasn't supposed to go in this one. Go see if I can get all the way over here. I should have put my hazards on too, but okay. Let's go see if I can get all the way over here. Okay. Uh oh, <laughs> I kind of screwed up here. Oh uh, well. Oh uh, well. Hi, how you doing? Man? Hi. I feel kind of embarrassed now. Uh oh. <laughs> I gotta get out of here now. I don't know what those outside lanes are for. I don't know what those outside lanes are for. Yeah, three more hours. Are we gonna be able to? Okay, so, um, so OCRP is accepting applications in July, again. So it's gonna be a while. Um, it's gonna be a minute. So, back in, next in July. So probably the first week in July, like they did last time. So, um, so I think. Twitch is going to be for OCRP if I do get accepted. See, my my things for OCRP, and I'm going to tell them. I'm going to be straight up with them. I'm going to be kind of, kind of a dick, actually. I'm going to tell them that why are you going to have a server if you're not going to let people openly broadcast it? Like, there's no point in it. Like, why are you going to regulate it so much? So, I will um, put in my application so they know that I will be broadcasting it to Twitch, to my YouTube channel, to anything I want to. They cannot regulate it because I'm going to broadcast it. Um, let me know down in the comments below if you guys are already... Um, um, an OCRP member, or if you guys even are part of the um, actual group, what the freak? 
I just got out of this. I just got out of this old thing. Uh, what was what's this about? Oh my gosh. So um, if you guys know anything about OCRP, if you guys are like a, if you guys are a member or something. Okay, nobody's coming that way, so I'm gonna grab this light real quick. If you guys are anything part of OCRP, let me know if there's any rules against that. If there are, um. Give, let me know a contact email because I actually um, when I found out that I ended up trying to get a contact email from um, DOJRP DOJRP never contacted me back about a contact email I said I have a, I have I, I have I have a problem that I need to contact you guys about can you please contact me with the contact email. Like through Twitter. Twitter. I call it Twitter. Man, this is whoa. I call it Twitter. <laughs> and they never contacted me back. So obviously they don't like don't like to have members that much. So and I thought that was kinda like I just don't understand that. Like like I thought like um, to have like an RP server. Oh, sorry guys, bump that back and forth. But like, I the whole point of having an RP server, like one of the main points at least, is to have the aspect of like, so you don't have to um, deal with a lot of things that GTA 5 itself their servers ha you have to deal with because one of the things you have to deal with the most is modding on the server that you're not allowed to mod there's there's no hacking like you can't hack anyway on DOJ, the DOJ or the OCRP but you can't you can't like mod whatsoever you can't put modded cars you can't run really a police of any sort and a lot of times you can't have you can't play any real games on the GTA 5 servers like you get a bunch of people running around doing stupid stuff so I was actually thinking about doing some sort of a fun um, thing like a, a series of some sort but it's like do I really want to because it's probably gonna end up really stupid so I don't know I'm still thinking about it. well sure I don't, don't have idea 80. But, um, I don't know. I'm still thinking about it. If OCRP doesn't work out, I really don't want to join a, um, or not join, but, like, find a non-members, um, RP server. Because if you find one of those, a lot of times they're not that good because they're not members, so he's got to start not. Um, so if you find one of those, a lot of times they're not that good because they're not members, so they they jump in and jump out a lot. They do, you know, they do a lot of stupid stuff. I think I did do that one time, and they were just not that. It was not that fun. I went, um, I did that one time. I found a non-member server, and it's like a free one where you just jump in. Just jump in, jump out. It's not fun. A lot of people are just walking around. It's a, it was a text chat one actually, and it's like this isn't fun. It's like, man, I gotta get out of here. And then I gotta get over. I gotta get over. I gotta get over. I hate those. That you have to get over all the time. So, anyway, so that's where I'm at with OCRP. Just waiting for July. Um, when July hits, I'll find, I'll, I'll see when the exact date is. It's 
guys so freaking annoying. I wonder if they have ELDs in um uh, Europe. I know in um America uh, they have ELDs. ELDs are electronic logs. Yeah, I don't know. If this, um, I don't know what the D stands for, but. Short-term electronic logs are the logs, the paper logs, but they're in electronic form, usually on a tablet or something. And a log is like where you tell the, you tell the government basically, what, what, what are your hours you're driving? Because so, you're supposedly only allowed to drive so many hours. And um, if you guys don't know about trucking, I'll let you guys know real quick. Um, logs are. Turn the lights on. There we go. Um, logs. I should have turned my oh. lights off. I'm only an hour and 20 minutes away. I really don't want to freaking go to sleep. Shoot. I really don't want to go to sleep. I'm only like an hour and a half away. That's an hour and a half away, dude. But electronic logs are paper, like the paper logs that truckers used to drive, use to tell the government what your, um, what you're driving, well, how many hours you're driving. You're only allowed to drive so many hours in a day. Um, and I think they send them in every year or something like that to make sure you're being legit. Well, this, I think this year, the end of this year, sometime this year, every trucker is going to electronic logs somehow. Some truckers are buying an app on their tablet or whatever and some truckers have are buying an actual tablet like device that are doing electronic logs basically the same thing you do on paper and it's like lines it's kinda like a graph basically and I've seen them before written out like they're it's not like it's not like super hard <sighs> it's got so freaking annoying Let's shut up but um but yeah so but the funny thing is, and I've like I watch because I watch truckers on YouTube and all that stuff. They're pretty cool, pretty cool videos to watch. But um, the funny thing about it is, electronic logs have not changed over the course of years. The thing that has changed is how they're supposed to be used. They used to be paper, and now they're electronic. So once they go to electronics people think they're changing somehow but they're not it's just how they're being recorded electronics you can't screw them up somehow like oh I was only driving for three hours but I was probably only driving for an hour and a half the, the, you know but with electronics it actually is going through the truck like it's somehow like you plug it into the truck somehow and the um the truck is actually telling the computer that you're going and you're going three hours well these older truckers don't like that they're thinking oh we want to go only two at one an hour and a half and he's getting he's closing his eyes a little bit well these people these older truckers I just don't understand them. And it starts raining. As soon as we get into our truck stop. Um, these older truckers, they just don't understand that. They think they think, oh we can we can screw them up. We can screw these logs all the time. We, we, oh, we only work, we only drove for an hour and a half. Oh, it's not like that anymore. They they think they think oh we, we need to stay at our old ways. It's like it's not like that anymore. It's like that is the only thing that's changed though, and they think and I just don't understand. I think it's so funny every time I watch a video about all oh, these electronic logs and these electronic logs. It's not, it's, the times haven't changed. Nothing has changed, dude only thing has changed is how it's being recorded 
you can't screw <sighs> can't screw with a electronic wall because it's coming from the truck but the truck is telling you not you you can't say oh I only drove an hour and a half no you drove three hours so it's kind of like so it's kind of like um so I guess it's kind of like a checking a check device for truck these older truckers and it's kind of like this now I just gotta Okay, we're gonna turn it like that. Okay, we're gonna go find the easiest way to do it, and we're gonna have to skip it out. Skip it, skip it, do that. Skip it, do that. Skip it, do that. Skip it, do that. <laughs> I'm gonna make myself laugh. Legend, legendary, legend. Wait for it. Hope you're not. Hope. One of my favorite ones on that is, wait for it, because I hope you're not um. Lactose intolerant, because it's gonna be dairy. <laughs> That's one of my favorite ones on that. Anyway, guys. So, um, gave you guys a little bit of um knowledge there. Um, let you guys know about my um intentions on OCRP. I'm gonna get um, OCRP all set up. Probably, um, probably gonna get that all. Um, hopefully, I will um, apply for that as soon as July hits. So this end of this month. Um, hopefully, things are gonna get ramped up pretty soon after June too. I'm gonna. I'm hoping a lot of stuff's gonna happen in, in this month, or at least I am going to be thinking of a lot of stuff in this month. My key of my key of this month. This month is going to be my. This month is a uh, wait and see. I guess you guys will know more that know more later. I guess. So, without further ado, the ado is done. So, I will see you guys in the next one. Um, I don't know what I'm going to do. I don't know if I'm going to do another video. It's only like seven o'clock, seven thirty ish. So I don't know if I'm going to do another video or um. I don't know yet, guys. So anyway, I'll see you guys in the next one, and I'll see you guys on the road.